Good morning. Uh, running time with me this morning. Um, yes, almost an hour and a half later. But I don't know, it was just one of those evenings I couldn't fall asleep. But uh, here we are. Eventually did and I'm out on my run. So thinking what I'd share with you today. And I think what, what I'd like to share with you is hashtag it starts with me. And I'll, I'll explain just now how I get to that. But um, I want to reflect a little bit this morning on COVID-19 and lockdown. And what's that meant for all of us? Um, if I look back, uh, I hope you agree with me and it would be fantastic if you can post in the remarks column later on after you've listened to this, what has COVID-19 meant for you? Uh, what has changed in your life? What has changed in your business? Now, for me, COVID-19 lockdown has definitely been a momentarily pause in life and cycles of things and busyness and, you know, all of a sudden we were just all forced to stop. And with stopping, you've got to like, what else do you do except looking inward and say, hey, am I happy with what I do? Am I happy with the way I do things? Um, I had one client saying, uh, and this is with great permission, he said to me, you know, I just stopped and I looked at myself and my business and with greatest permission, he said, I've realized I've got such a shit business and everything's got to change around that. And, you know, since having that coaching conversation, We've started changing things in his business and I checked in with him uh, again last week and he said, hey, you know, a lot of things have changed and, um, you know, I, I'm far more satisfied with what I have. So first of all, lockdown has definitely meant that we've stopped and we had to slow down. Uh, what else? Um, lockdown also meant that we had to be forced to be looking at the way that we do things. Um, you know, be more, more effective in terms of how we deliver, be more effective in terms of looking at our products and services, being far more effective in terms of how we're handling team. So lockdown has definitely done that as well. But I, I think the other thing it's also done is it showed the fragility of economies and businesses. You know, um, here comes COVID-19. And according to Co uh, World Economic Forum, uh, almost as much as 40% of businesses probably won't survive COVID-19. And this is on a global scale. And therefore, the, the, the sense of urgency uh, from me as a business coach to say, hey guys, you know, what are we waiting for? Let's have those conversations about your business. Um, the, the women entrepreneurs out there, you know, it's tough enough. But, you know, if you're looking to build a great business, if you are hopeful for your business and you want to really sell your business, let's have a conversation and build the business to value so that you can sell. Um, moms and dads, are you in a business where um, it's a legacy business, you want to leave it for the next generation, but uh, there's some transition and leadership development that needs to happen. Let's have that conversation and, you know, get to a point where you can now move on. So, yeah, COVID-19 has showed the fragility of, of, of economies and businesses. And it's time that we take that serious and that uh, time to really invest our time and energy in building great business with value. One that you can sell or pass on to the next generation. What else have we done? Uh, yeah, family dinners is now a thing again, you know, spending time with loved ones has become precious. And I think that's what COVID did as well. You know, it just made us realize there are some things that we can do without and there's other things that, um, yeah, it's really precious. Um, so therefore, hashtag, it, stay, it starts with me. And that's what I want to leave you with today. You know, uh, if we are to change the way our lives are and what we do and the results of our lives and our businesses, you know, hashtag it starts with me. If you want uh, a more successful business, well, it starts with you. If you want a more motivated, engaged team, well, then in, invest in your own leadership because, you know, it starts with your leadership. Um, again, hashtag it starts with me. So um, therefore, my, my hashtag this morning, and I'd like to get some comments, guys. I'm going to post this as usual this morning. Very freezing, cold Western Cape. But um, do me the favor and, and, and comment in terms of what COVID-19 has meant for you. What changes have you made in your life and in your business? And um, can, we, can we take this hashtag, it starts with me, going forward and um, understand that whatever we want in life and in business, it starts with the changes that we are prepared to make. So I'm out of here, got to complete my run. Have a fantastic Friday and whatever you do, remember, hashtag it starts with me. Cheers.